Why did the British wear red coats? Why did any army or soldier throughout all history wear brightly colored uniforms? Wouldn't it have been better for them to wear camouflage and to hide in battle? Well, no. They wanted to be seen. They needed to be seen. It was for communication, for coordination. Battles are confusing places. It is hard to tell who's friend and foe. Even today, with the radio communication, it is hard to tell. And in certain periods, especially in the time of musketry, there was a literal, physical fog of war. The fog and smoke from muskets would obscure one's vision. If every army decided to go into battle to wear, wearing green so they would blend in with the vegetation, when you saw someone approaching, you would not know if they're a friend or foe, so you would fire at them in that case, and then discover you just shot Bobby, your friend, who was on your side. You don't want to shoot Bobby. You want to shoot Hans over there. But if you're all wearing green, you can't tell the difference between Bobby or Hans. But if you are wearing red, and your allies are wearing red, and... Hands wearing whatever other color. Well, you know, don't shoot those wearing red. Shoot those wearing the other colors. That is why they wore brightly colored uniforms. So they knew who was friend and foe. And so the commanders could see where their men were and give them commands and know what they needed to have them do. Now, in smaller scale battles, like little skirmishes where you don't really have a full battle, you don't even have thousands of men, you don't even have hundreds, yeah, you could wear camouflage. There were units who did that. There, during the Napoleonic Wars, the Prussians had a Jaeger Corps, or Mean Hunter Corps, who wore green and were sharpshooters. And now because they were smaller units, it was meant for picking up officers, they could hide and wouldn't have to worry about being shot by their own men because they weren't in the heat of the battle. And if you look... During Victorian era, in British colonies, often small units would wear khaki as they would mostly be in small groups knowing who their allies were as they would stay close together with small units. So they knew anyone who wasn't them who was charging them with a weapon was foe. But when it came to these large-scale battles, as you did not have radios to communicate with each other, it was important to know who friend or foe was, so you wore bright colors to see. And if we look at earlier times, often soldiers would, back in times where they had shields, cover their shields with the insignia of their leader. So you knew, I am with that leader. See the insignia on shield. Roman legions did a likewise thing on their shields. And now knights in medieval times often wore brightly colored things on their armor and their insignia on their shields. So if they were in battle and got surrounded, the enemy want to capture them instead of killing them, as capturing a noble and ransoming them off was a lot more valuable than killing them. And if you managed to capture a king, you could convince him to capitulate, which would be a lot more valuable than just killing them after continue fighting. That are the reasons why you might wear bright colors in battle. Like and subscribe.